Yeehaw! Welcome back to Redneck Snack and Food Reviews. It's been a bit of a long day, folks. Um, you know, it's weird trying to talk about my day because I know, like, the review goes up. Like, these reviews that I do go up at different times, so. But it really has been. First, Starbucks was closed in the morning, and I had to go and run after work and get that. Um, to review it. That was fun, but, you know, why, why am I disappointed? You may be wondering, like, what, what's this guy's problem? Well, when I do these Buffalo Wild Wings reviews, I typically like to do the bone-in wings, and so, unfortunately, you're gonna get chicken nuggets for this review. Um, everyone calls boneless wings chicken nuggets. I do too, um, but I waited so long and just drove home and now I've got to submit a complaint. Um, these places doing wings, A, they're busy, so I guess, it, I guess I can understand it, but like, come on, man, come on. Anyways, I, I don't want to, I don't want to bother y'all with my frustration here, but it was supposed to be six bone-in wings. But tonight's buy one, get one free bonus. And so they were probably thinking I said bonus. I'm like, no, 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 no. <sighs> I swear. And like, I try and understand. I try and have some compassion, some understanding for when people, and I, I've never worked in food service, but I try and have understanding, folks. I really do. And I know you're probably like, I'm going to dislike this video because this guy's bad and rambling. But, like, I've worked at places. Like, I've had jobs and I've been busy. And I don't tend to forget things. I don't get things wrong that often. It's very rarely. So, I just don't understand why, in the past couple weeks, these wing places just have been messing up. You know, uh... Applebee's messed up my Cheetos order um, from the Uber Eats app, and they have not responded to my complaint. And I'm not trying to sound like a Karen. I'm just like, I want places to get things right. I want them to do things right. And sometimes instructions can be a little bit tough, but when I say I want bone and wings, it really shouldn't be hard. But anyways, that's aside from the plan. I don't want to bother y'all anymore. Um positive things let's go with that first let's start out on the right foot after being on the wrong foot for a long time please subscribe like comment and share and check out my instagram read next snack and food i don't have a problem with bone, bonus wings but again every time i do about for the wings i try and do bone in for y'all um and i think y'all like that a lot more and so usually i'm like usually on the beat on this uh buffalo wild wing stuff like i'm usually reviewing it like the day of and uploading it the day of but it is a little bit late so i may not get as many views as usual but that's okay anyway well i did do a but one of my most viewed videos was bonus wings but people got mad and disliked it so we'll see what happens here um but anyways let's get to the point walked out with the bag didn't look obviously what had me in a good mood and what has me still in a, a pretty decent mood here is you could you, you don't even have to open the box or anything you you just walk with the bag and you can smell the truffle so if you like truffle i'm pretty much going to guarantee you you're going to like this you there's there's a very low chance that you will not like this unless you hate buffalo um and i haven't even tried it but i'm telling you you can smell truffle from a mile away out of this box. It was that strong of a smell. Hopefully it's not overly strong, but it has me a bit excited. So I'm not the huge Buffalo fan, but I eat everything. I'm fine with everything. So I am a little bit excited here, maybe too excited. Let's go ahead and look at these. Sorry, I look a bit rough right now. It's been a long day at work. But yeah, let's go ahead and try these. Um, again, it's just chicken. Um, there's no big difference between a wing 
and a, a bone and wing and a boneless wing. You get more chicken and it's cheaper um, for boneless. But, you know, I just like chewing on the wing. I like gnawing on the wing, you know. I was in the mood for boneless the other day when I got the Cheeto wings and they did it right for that. So that's fine. But I really was hoping for bone in. But let's just get to the point, try this out, and uh, hopefully you maybe will go try this if I like it. I don't know. Hmm. That's exactly as it should be. A nice... Ooh, it, it, it's got a kick to it. A nice heaty buffalo flavor with a good amount of truffle. If you've never had truffle before, um, it's definitely out there in terms of flavor. Um, and it might not be for you. I love truffle. I honestly do. It's like a very distinct flavor. It's kind of hard to like explain what truffle is. Um, but I'm really trying to think of something that would be a good description. Hmm. Kind of like, so they make truffle oil and stuff. It's kind of like an oil type of thing. It's like a lot of times, it's like, it's not vinegar. But it's like caught that kind of substance to it, um, almost. And like when you want a truffle fries, those things are so greased up from this like truffle oil. And I also got like a dry truffle uh, seasoning, but it's like this really distinct kind of herby type of taste um, that is, it, it keeps your mind going, ooh, this is an interesting, you know, flavor. And I believe they got the right amount in here. Um, it's not too much. It's not too little either. But it was just enough to get that smell rolling. I wouldn't say it's a 10 per se. Um, but it is a very good sauce. I would say it could, yeah, it could kick down the heat a little bit. I have no problem with it, but I was thinking maybe, like, for people who just want a more mild buffalo kind of flavor here, you know, so it pleases everyone. And they also charge a dollar more for this. So... That's another downside to it. But it is good. Um, I can't give it a 10. I think I'm going to give it a 9. I'm sorry, 9, 9. I'm going to give it an 8. Um, because it delivers on the truffle flavor. It's got a nice amount of buffalo. But I don't like that it's an extra dollar. And um, it is a little too spicy. Not for me. But for other people, it would probably be a no. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, other than the, the disappointment that these weren't bone in, I'm pretty satisfied. The flavor's good. It's what I expected. Buffalo, truffle, makes truffle So yeah. Um, again, Buffalo Islands, a little too pricey, but um, these things happen. So anyways, if you want to go eat Buffalo Wild Wings and you're feeling fancy, Hit the truffle wings. You won't regret it. So, yep, that's all I got. Hopefully, you'll be back. 
And if not, oh well, peace out. But if you are back, I'll see y'all around. Yee yee!